What is your proudest career achievement? I don't know that I look at it that way. You know, I don't, I, I don't take any more pride in one thing or another. I, uh, you know, I mean, I think Rain Man in the idea that it was the first film that really created the awareness of autism and put it on the, uh, into the language, you know, uh, and, and, and what it was. Because I, I remember getting a, a, a letter from a, a mother of an autistic boy, and she was saying that the film, you know, by saying autism, that I, I'm, I'm finally able to say what he has and people will understand. Mm -hmm because I was always trying to explain his condition and I never could explain it and no one understood. And that the, move, the, the film defined that and then the awareness came from it. So that, that's always a byproduct of a film you make is that somehow it, it, here, this is autism. This is what it is. And to the, to the mothers and the fathers, you know, uh, to the brothers and the sisters of an autistic, you know, you know, kid, it, it's now clear. Where before, you know, it was sort of ill-defined in a way, and so the awareness that came from it, you know, but you you can't predict any of those things. Right. You you can certainly say I'm I'm glad that happened, but you 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 can't aim for that. All you can do is try to hold somebody's attention for X number of hours and try to take them on some kind of a journey. Right. Uh, that's the best you can do. Do you have any career regrets? Sometimes you'd say, I, w I wish I could have explained something better. You know, uh, uh, and um, you know, I'm sure in the mix of it all, you know, there, there, I, don't th I don't think I have great regrets in terms of what I was doing. I tried to do what I could. I never, I never took a project because I thought, oh, this is a lot of money, I'll do that. Or I never d took a project because I thought, well, this will be a big hit. You know what I mean? There's no way you're going to do a Rain Man and say, oh, yeah, this will be a big hit. I'm going to make a lot of money off of this story about autism on the road. Um, you know, or, you know, look, I was told, you know, don't make Good Morning Vietnam because, you know, Robin is the kiss of death. You know, he can't make it as a feature actor. You know, so, but... You know, you're going to win some battles and you're going to lose some of those battles. And you're going to be right and you're going to be wrong. Mm. And nothing can change that. You know, that's just, that's just part of it because there's, I don't know how else you do it. You know, it's a, it, it, you can put in all the safeguards you want to, to suddenly be a success and it still may fail. And so the only thing you rely on is what is it that will motivate me to want to work and give a, you know, in a feature like a year of your life or six months for, you know, to, to set up a pilot and do all that, etc. cetera. Uh, what is it that motivates you enough to spend that much time and interest if you didn't really care? Right. We have one last question. Yep. We ask all of our interviewees, how would you like to be remembered? You know... I don't, I don't know that I can answer the question because I, there, are, there are some people that I think did great work that are completely forgotten. And so when you say, how do you want to be remembered? Uh, in a sense, to me, it's like, uh, it's, it's like asking for something that may or may not be.